Hello to all of my viewers and students. Thank you very much for getting back to me. Most often you may have felt the need to determine the statistical properties of your demographic data collected in your survey studies. Am I right? The demographic variables such as age, marital status, education level, gender, ethnicity, religion, income group, occupation or family structure are usually studied by calculating their descriptive statistics. Sometimes you may need to know about the diversity of your group demographic variables to understand overall impact of your qualitative variables on other study variables. Now the question arises how to test the group demographic diversity. Since demographic variables are tapped at nominal or ordinal levels, we can test the group demographic heterogeneity in our qualitative variables. To test this, we need to calculate Bloch's index of heterogeneity. For instance, you have following education level data. Number one is equal to college education and your count is one. Number two is equal to undergrad university education and your count is three. Mean you have three respondents. And number three is postgrad university education and you have six count. Now proceed as follows. Total count is equal to college education and the count is one. Undergrad university education and the count is three. And postgrad university education and the count is six. Now the formula for Bloch's index of heterogeneity is one minus sigma pi square where pi is the proportion of group members in each of the i categories now calculate the proportions so the proportions are 0 0.10 0 0.30 and 0 0.60 mean 1 is the 10 percent of 10 and 3 is the 30 percent of 10 and 6 is the 60 percent of 10 and total count is 10 which is 100 percent take the square of the proportions now total square proportions are for college education 0 0.01 for undergrad university education 0 0.09 and for postgrad university education 0.36 now add these total square proportions 0 0.01 plus 0 0.09 plus 0.36 it's equal to 0.46 now Bloch's index of heterogeneity is 1 minus total so 1 minus 0 0.046 is equal to 0.54 so you have got your Bloch's index of heterogeneity for this sample is equal to 0.54 Always remember that values close to zero are interpreted as homogeneous and values close to one are interpreted as heterogeneous. I hope now you can easily check group demographic diversity for your other qualitative variables. Thank you very much for attending me today. Okay, Dr. Uh, Alan Van Jacob, are you prepared to move forward? Yes, I can. Okay, the, uh, Dr. Lon Ben Jacobs, he actually took us up on the offer to publish with the International Journal of Management, Economics, and Social Sciences. This is one of the things that we are prepared to do as a group to help you get published in a peer reviewed journal. So, uh, Dr. Jacob, before you move forward with that, I'd like you to discuss a little bit about your experience and then go right into your presentation. Yes, sure. Gladly. So, good morning, everyone. Good afternoon. I'm in the West Coast, so it depends when you are, where you are in the globe. Uh, I finished my uh, DBA early this year, and toward the end of the... Of the uh, the dissertation approval and discussion I try to, to publish in uh, several uh, um, magazine and, and I didn't succeed. Uh, I connected with, uh, with Dr. Rivers and the, and the society and I uh, shared my, my passion in publishing my, uh, my topic, which was 
similar to what I will uh, discuss now in the presentation. And uh, Dr. Rivers, he escorted me uh, and uh, allowed me to, to publish the, the article. It was a process of uh, three to four months that it took a lot of back and forth. And uh, I learned that it's, I, I cannot use the same dissertation. I would need to put my inner voice, my academic uh, 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 background and study, and I would need to, to turn it into something a bit different than what I, I thought it would be. And, and again, after three or four months, we were able, I was able to, to publish. It was published uh, mid-September. So and I'm very proud and honored to, to get this escort and the support from the, from the DBA Society team. So thank you.